Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, you may have noticed that it's a little brighter in here than normal. I got an LED desk lamp to try to make the lighting in my videos better. Um, if you guys like it, let me know down in the comments. If you guys don't like it, then tell me and I will not turn it on anymore. So, if you are new here and you'd like to follow me on my magical Harry Potter collection journey, you can hit the subscribe button down below. Today, I have another Harry Potter haul for you guys. I am still waiting for my ge gearbox to get here. Hopefully, it'll be here either tomorrow or Monday. If it gets here tomorrow, you'll get another video tomorrow because I'm super excited to open it. Uh, so, the stuff I got today, I went to GameStop and Walmart. And I got a couple more of like the mystery mini things. I'm trying to do different stuff in my videos because... I mean, I don't want it all to be the same, the same old stuff every time I do a video, so I got two of these bad boys, and then it shows you all the ones you can get on the back. I already have the Thestral, so two of those, and I got three more of these. Last time I got only one of these, and we got Dumbledore's Wand, so I'm really hoping we can get some different ones. I got three of these. I think I already said that, but... so. I dropped that. So we're going to start off <laughs> with um, the mystery minis. We'll open both of those and then we'll open the wands and then I'll show you the other things that I've got today. Let me pick up this mystery wand. Okay. Now, we'll open these bad boys up. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm a little under the weather. I uh, fell down these stairs in my apartment the other day. And I hurt myself pretty bad, my tailbone and um, my back mostly. So, crap happens, I guess. At least I wasn't holding my baby right. <laughs> right, okay. First mystery box. Crud. There we go. These things never want to work with me. Oh. Okay. This feels like maybe a person... I don't think it feels like a creature. Let's see what's in here. Oh, this is cool. Look. So this is an owl, I'm going to say. I haven't seen Crimes of Grindelwald yet. And I've only seen um, Fantastic Beasts a couple times, even though I do own it. So this is pretty neat, though. They're nice and solid. And they're very cute. I like him because it doesn't tell you but it tells you how rare it is so this was a one in six chance of getting this so it's not too completely rare okay throw that on the floor we don't need that let's get one of these we're pulling it and I'm going to do the second one hopefully we don't get the same thing I'll be kind of disappointed I really want a Niffler, but I doubt we'll get one. I usually hardly ever get my way with these things. Okay. Ah, I already know what this is. Sweet. So, we got, <laughs> we got Pickett. Pickett. And he is a 1 in 24, so he's a little bit more rare to get out of one of these. But that's awesome. I love Pickett. Will he stand on his own? Oh, guys, he stands on his own. Look. I'll move the camera so you guys can... Oh, my hand's in the way. But see? He's standing. That's so cool. Alright. Sorry, I don't usually move my cameras during my videos, but... That's super cool. He stands on his own. Okay. Well, happy with that. So, let's move on to these. Now, if you remember from last time, these are 4-inch die-cast wands with stands. And they are very nice. And last time I got the Elder Wand, which of course is Dumbledore's Wand. So you can get Harry, Victor, Remus's, Newt, Ron's, Hermione's, Albus's, Serafina's, Alastor's, or Sirius Black's Wand in these. So let's pop this sucker open and see what we got. I got three of them, so hopefully we get all different wands and no duplicates. No duplicates. Okay, let's see. Huh. I think, pretty sure this is Sirius Black's wand. 
Well, there are two wands above Sirius Black's name there. So this one is like silver. It's very pretty. Very pretty. Very detailed. And there's all these like intricate carvings and stuff around it. But it's silver. It's very, very, very pretty. Let's get the stand out and we'll put it on the stand. I love these ones. There's 11 of them that you can get. So now I have two. <coughs> Sorry guys, like I said, I think I'm getting a cold. Which is kind of unfortunate, but I'm just going to roll with it. So let's put the stand together here. These things are really cool. Um, I get them at my Walmart, my local Walmart. They're $4.88. The mystery minis are $5.44 a piece. So. But these are $4.88. So we have Sirius Black's Wand. I think that light might be too. Is that better? So we did half the video in the crazy light. We're going to do the other half in this light. And you guys tell me what's better. So here it is again in the stand. It's very pretty. I just think that that light had too harsh of a glare. I got new light bulbs for my actual big lamp too though. Alright. Second one. Like I said, I'm sick. Excuse the sniffles. Not really professional. Oh, cool. We got Harry's wand. So this, I think it's Harry's wand. Hold on a minute. Because Harry's and Ron's are very similar. It might be Ron's. Let's look. I'll get it out and I'll show it to you guys. And you guys can tell me down in the comments. But I think it's Ron's because the wooden piece up here isn't as long and as thick as Harry's is on his wand. So here it is. Like I said, I think it's Ron's. Very nice wand. It's bumpy. They don't just do these straight. They put detail into them, which is nice. So we'll put it on its stand. Well, good. No duplicates yet. Jeez. Be nice if I could open stuff, you know. <laughs> Today is just not my day. I had to go to Walmart and Kroger, and I went to GameStop. I stopped at Walgreens to see if they had anything cool. They didn't. So, I have had a busy day already, and I haven't even made supper yet. So, there it is. Ron's wand in, his, in the little stand. I put Ron's wand, the uh, part that you hold up, because that's the part with the... Uh... Oop. Oh, jeez. It fell. <laughs> hold on. That's the part with the most detail. So, I'll put his standing like that. Last one. I really want Hermione's or Serafina's. Hermione and Serafina's ones are beautiful. So, let's see what we get. Okay, this one's cool. Oh, we got Newt's Commander's wand, guys. Newt's wand's also pretty. For, I mean, a guy's wand, but it's... Let me get it out and I'll show you guys. They're in this plastic and kind of sucks, but okay, we got Newt's wand. So there's this pretty turquoisey. Let's see. Pretty turquoisey color up here, as you can see. The wand itself is like a light brown color. And then this is really pretty. Okay. That light is too harsh. So this is really pretty and detailed. And then in the end here, it's like, got silver. So, new Scamander's wand. That's awesome. Don't need that box. So we got Sirius Ron, Sirius won't, I don't know. Excuse me. We got Ron, Sirius, and Newt Scamander's wand. Since I can't talk today. And I don't know if you guys know this or not. You probably do if you've watched my other videos. I don't know how to edit these things yet. <laughs> I am working on getting better at this. Just started. So I'm not very good at, you know, hardly any of it yet. But there's Newt's wand. That's awesome. And they're all so cool. Okay. Anyway, so I don't edit these. Because I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how to edit. So I kind of just go with it. <laughs> 
um, something happens in the video that I really don't like that does, really bothers me, I just redo the video over. Next, from Walmart, I got a full-size pop. So this is Gilderoy, Gilderoy Lockhart. Can't talk today. And he is in his tan robes. So there he is. Here's the back of the other ones that you could have gotten. Now, I already have Harry and the Mandrake, Ron and the Mandrake, Tom and Tom Riddle. So I need Jenny, Hermione with the Mandrake, and Nearly Headless Nick out of this set. So we'll get him out and look at him. Um, I got this from Walmart. Nothing too spectacular. They do have another Gilroy Rock. They do have another Gilderoy Pop, um, where he is in his blue robes, but I believe those are Barnes & Noble exclusives, so this was $8.28 or something, not too expensive, so there he is, very nice pop, does look like Gilderoy, so, I wish they had him smiling with, like, some creepy teeth, though, that would totally be like him, <laughs> We'll put him back in the box. And then I will show you guys the couple of goodies that I got from GameStop. So. Also, I have been looking up um, other subscription boxes, Harry Potter subscription boxes, that I may want to order. Um, I've heard some bad things recently about Loot Crate, which is J.K. Rowling's box that she does. Um, it's all licensed Harry Potter stuff. But apparently, it hasn't been good the past few months. And then the other box that I wanted to order, the Gobstone Alley box, which also comes out of the UK, I have also heard terrible stuff about here lately. Which makes me sad because that was like the best box out there. But they're really behind on all their owl posts and whatnot. So I may order another subscription box. I may just stick with Geek Gear. Um, maybe I'll get the wearable edition from Geek Gear. So we'll see. Alright, so I got two things at GameStop. The first thing I got was this cute, it's metal, Funko Pop style Dobby keychain. It was $5.99. And of course, it's licensed. So, I got that. I just thought it would be cute to hang up with all my other keychains. Because I probably wouldn't hang this on my keys, it's too big. But. The next thing I got that I saw last time I was in there when I got my um, brawn pop on the chest piece is the Baby Niffler 2-pack. So I got these because I don't have very many Crimes of Grindelwald pops yet. Actually, this is my second large Crimes of Grindelwald pop. The only other one that I have is the Mooncalf. So there's that, and this is actually a cool box. This was $22.99 for both of these. So... And I was going to take them out and show you guys, but I think I might save that for another video because I'm not sure how hard it'll be to get them back in the box. But I got those. I saw them in there last time, and I, I really wanted them, so I got them. Very nice. Very nice. I'll show you the side of the box here. And then here. And then the Nifflers are just kind of like my keychain ones, only I think they're in different positions. So I have both of these as pop keychains but they're in different positions. So, lots of magical Harry Potter goodness today, which of course you guys know I love to get lots of magical Harry Potter goodness. Uh, thank you for joining me in this Harry Potter haul. Um, hopefully I'll be able to do a quite larger one that may span into more than two or three videos. Here soon we're waiting on our taxes to come back. And we are going to go have a pop hunt. My fiance collects the Overwatch stuff, the Overwatch pops and stuff. He loves Overwatch, so that'll be exciting for him. He doesn't have any Overwatch pops yet. We did get a Funko, it was called a Funko Mystery Box from GameStop. It was 20 bucks. It came with a pop. Um a Pez Pop pin, it's a Pez Pop thing, a little Funko plushie, a little badge, and some glow-in-the-dark stars, which was strange. 
but it didn't have anything Harry Potter related in it. Um, so I didn't put it in the video, but yeah, like I said, my Geek Gear box should be here either tomorrow or Monday. I'm hoping for tomorrow because I cannot wait. I was really disappointed when I went out to check the mail and there was nothing out there. So there's that. But I hope you guys have a really good day. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. So thanks. Bye.